my name is Andrea McKinney, Public Information Officer at the Florida Department of Health in Collier County. Zika virus is an illness spread primarily from the bite of an infected mosquito. Zika can also be transmitted in the womb, at the time of birth, during a blood transfusion, and during sex. Zika is a mild illness. Only about one in five people infected with Zika virus experience any symptoms. The most common signs and symptoms are fever, rash, joint pain, and red eyes. Symptoms can last from several days to a week. There's no specific treatment for Zika. You treat the symptoms by getting plenty of rest, drinking fluids to prevent dehydration, and taking medicine to relieve fever and pain. Zika infection during pregnancy can cause serious birth defects, such as microcephaly. Zika virus is also associated with other neurological conditions in adults. If you are pregnant and have a partner who lives in or has traveled to an area with Zika, abstain from sex or use condoms every time during your pregnancy. The Florida Department of Health established a Zika virus information hotline. That telephone number is 1-855-622-6735. Any pregnant woman who would like to be tested for Zika can do so at their local county health department for free. The best way to prevent Zika is to prevent mosquito bites. The Florida Department of Health encourages Florida residents and visitors to protect themselves from all mosquito-borne illnesses by draining standing water, covering their skin with repellent and clothing, covering windows with screens, and other basic precautions. Even really small amounts of water can be a breeding site for mosquitoes. That is why it's so important to eliminate all sources of standing water, no matter how seemingly small. Whether you're staying at home or traveling abroad, preventing mosquito bites is the best way to reduce the risk of mosquito-borne disease. The Department of Health in Collier County, the Collier Mosquito Control District, and the Collier County Bureau of Emergency Services are working together to prevent mosquito-borne disease in our community. Every individual that lives, works, or visits this county and state has a role in combating this disease. We all have a role in preventing Zika in our communities.